So every single time this uh, legend, this legend that I call Mr. Common Sense or Captain Common Sense uh, uploads a video, it's usually completely worthless. Uh, that's the reason why I call him Captain Common Sense, because usually it's just, uh, you know, three to four minutes of him spewing common sense at you and then six minutes of useless bullshit just to make the video longer so you can put mid-roll ads on it and make more money. So I figured I'd finally actually say something. I'd finally actually do something. And uh, we're going to take a look at his Raditz video. So let's see how Captain Common Sense will give you the best EX Raditz guide. All right, the best way to grind them, right? When you think of an EX or a, a, a best guide, right? This is something you look up when you've already played the event. You don't look this shit up before you've even opened the game. If you do, why are you that pathetic? So let's just let's just set let's just set it up, right? Let's just set this whole thing up. You've played through the event. You've done the challenges, right? And you started, you know, doing the grind. You're like, ah, oh, there's got to be a better or, you know, well, yeah, just a better way of doing this. So you look up the guide, you see this fucker's video, right? And aside from being a complete waste of your time, <sighs> let's just go over his points first, okay? Let's just... Just get right into it. Let's go over his points. The first thing that he mentions is uh, grab the 500 Awaken Z power from the, from the missions. Oh. <laughs> oh, really now? I'm sure when someone looked in the missions or even just by playing, you don't even have to do anything, really. You could, you could clear that mission by accident and without even looking at the requirements. And then when you went into the missions, you'd get that done. I don't think you need to tell people to do that. I, I, I really don't think people are that stupid. You don't need to tell them to grab the 500 Z power from the missions. All right, so what's the next thing he says? He says, you have to beat normal mode uh, and go into the hard mode to get the Awakened Z power. And the f I, when, I, when I watched that the first time, I audibly went... No shit. <laughs> because it's not like I played the event before watching this video like a normal fucking person. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I would have seen that, hey, normal difficulty doesn't have the Awakened Z power. Whoa. I would have never known. I thought I was just seeing things. Thank you for confirming to me that I did not see Awaken Z power on normal difficulty. All right. So what's the next thing? The next and most important thing for a best guide, he actually he actually tells you to take it slowly. What? <laughs> That's like the opposite of what a guide is supposed to do. It's supposed to show you what the fastest possible method is, not the slowest possible method. I don't think slow would be considered best, but I guess that I guess that's subjective, whatever your idea of the best way to do it is, whatever. So what what is his grand plan? What is what is this entire video round to, right? He tells you not to waste your skip tickets on the one stage. Uh, he tells you not to waste your stage or wait waste your stage. Waste your skip tickets on the uh, one stage that gives you the awakened Z power and instead just do the uh, daily mission or the, the daily stage, the once per day stage because it gives you a hundred awakened Z power every day and the event doesn't have a date at which it's going to disappear. It's going to stay there forever. Really? R really? So you're telling me that if I want to take things slowly and, you know, want to save my resources, I just do the once per day mission. Okay. And? that That's it? That's it. So you made an entire video just to tell people to do the once per day mission if they want to take it slowly and save their resources. 
See what I mean? By Captain Common Fucking Sense? Who the hell would not think of that? Like, like genuinely, if you have the mindset of, I want to save my resources, I don't really care about getting him to Zenkai 7, you know, in 24 goddamn hours. Wouldn't the logical thing to do be, you know, do the once per day mission, maybe, you know, chuck a couple skip tickets a day in, maybe go, maybe go through 10 energy a day on the skip ticket one, just to speed it up a little bit, and let that be that? I don't see anything here that isn't common sense. And then he spends six fucking minutes talking about things that have nothing to do with the grind. They have to do with Raditz, I guess. Half your video's title is correct, but literally only 30% of your video is actually dedicated to the title. And that 30% is filled with nothing but common sense. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> like, what? Like, genuinely, that would be like me uploading a 30-minute video telling you how to breathe and it all round roundabouts uh, itself to just me telling you to inhale and exhale. I do that in the first 12 minutes and then the rest of the video is me talking about how your lungs, uh, you know, expand when oxygen goes in them. Technically, it still has to do with breathing, but it has nothing to do with teaching you how to breathe. Also, you shouldn't need a video to teach you how to fucking breathe. That's not common sense. That's a natural thing. Your brain literally doesn't even have to tell your body to breathe. It just does that. You have to force yourself not to breathe. It's so beyond common sense. You don't need me to tell you how to fucking breathe. And you don't need this asshole telling you to take things slow and do the daily mission. Or the daily stage. I keep saying mission. Do the daily stage. So while editing... Uh, this video, I came across this little gem. It's not as long as the other one, granted, but you want to know what's funny? He doesn't even talk about the Raditz event until halfway into the video. His, this is another video that only needed to be three minutes long, but instead of being three times, not even, instead of being almost four times as long, this one is just twice as long. And he, like, the first half of his video has nothing to do with the title. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> has to do with Raditz. Does not have to do with... This one is actually How to Zenkai uh, Raditz EX Fast Guide. So this is a fast guide. I have not actually seen the entire thing yet. Me and you, we are going to watch it together. But we're going to skip till about this part right here. Because that's, that's when he actually starts talking about the Zenkai Awakening power. So let's just actually, you know, let's just let's go right into it. It's where we can grind uh, this Awakening Teeth power for Raditz. Let's take a look into that. So here we are. This is the new event uh, for Raditz. This is the yes. normal mode. But in order to get the Zenkai Awakening Teeth power, we need to go to the hard mode. And it's on the last stage. Uh, there's no common sense need, guys so just make sure you complete all the missions which are pretty easy no shit and complete uh i and just use your skip tickets you know guys we recently got the new energy update so basically guys uh it's faster to do this than before so just it would seem your that his grand guide Evan, and then just go ahead and pause that so it would seem that his grand guide to uh to zenkai and raditz the fastest is to just use your skip tickets again why does this video need to exist are you that desperate for content 
I hate playing the game, and yet I still find a way to upload a video every single day on it. How are you that desperate for content? Or is it the fact that you know when putting in a how-to, the title of that video will get you views because people assume you have some grand revelation. People assume you're going to tell them something that they don't already know. It's clickbait at its fucking finest, and it pisses me off. <laughs> like, genuinely. They bait you in with these best guides. Zenkai, Zenkai, I'm fast. And then it's just, do the daily missions if you want to take them, the daily stage, son of a bitch, if you want to take them slow. Use your skip tickets if you want to do it as fast as possible. Really? Common sense? Fuck you. And your goddamn common sense. Why do these videos even exist? They have no reason to exist. Also, just just a little uh, just a little tip for you. Maybe when you crop the uh, the screen, bring it up a little bit so that the bottom buttons aren't cut off at the bottom of the screen. You have space at the top uh, up here. Just move the screen up a little bit. That's, that's, that's just a personal point. It's just my OCD kicking in, though. <laughs> anyway. Oh, my God. This video needs to end now. I'm sure there's more of them. Hell, let, I was, I was going to say, like, let me search for them. But I don't want to subject myself to YouTubers that literally only exist for clickbait. And it's, it's, it's the clickbait that gets the thousands of views, too. That's, that's what pisses me off even more. It's the clickbait that gets the thousands of views. Yeah, whatever. Like, <laughs> whatever. I bet you if I made a how-to Zenkai a Android 18 and told you to summon on the fucking banner, you'd all be pissed. <laughs> but that's basically what this is. This is no different than me Telling you the fastest way to Zenkai 18 is to summon on her banner. <laughs> I, I, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Fuck it.